today's video i'm going to be doing another day in my life so i'm going to work later um i'm gonna get myself together i'm gonna get my toes done get a massage get my eyebrows done all that stuff um right now i'm about to go take my friend to her doctor's appointment she just got her boobs done yesterday so it's her follow-up appointment and obviously she can't drive when you get your boots done. She's on drugs and obviously she's sore. So she lives right next door to me. Um, so I'm gonna go pick her up. So I just got home. I took her to the appointment and she wasn't feeling well so the medicine was making her like real sick. And then we got some food. So I'm eating my salad. I dropped her off. Look at the baby. So I'll get to feed my dogs, do like little stuff. Um, and then I'm waiting on my friend to get here and then we're gonna go to the spa. Guys, I'm here with my friend, Hi. baby Vanessa. Uh, we're at the spa, so I'll show you guys inside. It's so nice. It's King Spa, it's in Niles, Illinois. I think they have one in Florida. All right, so this is the uniform. We're gonna do the V-steam and then a scrub massage all in one. <laughs> Me and gang, say hi. hi. <laughs> We're getting our little V steam on, you know what I'm saying? Oh. Little Toto. No, that's <laughs> <definitely> tight, <laughs> but I'm gonna show you guys basically what the V steam is and what they do and what they put in it. Um, it's basically a little hot bowl and then it steams up and with a bunch of like little herbs. Good for your Toto. So this is what the seats look like, and then you sit on them. She's cleaning them right now, so that's why they're like a little wet. But yeah, so these are the seats. They have little holes, so that's obviously where your vagina would be. And then that's what they put in it. So you guys want to read that. So those are all the benefits of it. And it helps with period cramps, too. So. All right, so we're eating at the spa, y'all. She got a, what is it? It's a quail egg. A quail egg. I'm scared. Gross. I got some aloe juice or aloe water. I'm sorry, they make it fresh here. Mm -hmm. This is what the place looks like. All right, guys, we got my food. This is the sweet and spicy chicken, miso soup. Got some white rice right there, fire. And we got some salmon. All right, y'all, so I just got my massage. So it's basically a scrub massage and everything honestly all in one they do like this little gel mask on you like the one you peel off but it's like all gel so they do that one they wash your hair i told her not to wash my hair because i don't know what products they use and i can't use alcohol in my hair because my extensions will fall out i have tape and extensions so yeah but the massage bomb my skin feels so soft and then at the end they put milk on your skin it's so nice 10 out of 10 recommend all right, y'all, I don't got no makeup on and clearly my hair is still wet. I just got out the shower. I'm about to head to work. It's 10 p.m., but I'm gonna get ready to work, so I'll be ready like midnight. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna head to work 10 p.m. on a Sunday, so Sunday, Sunday. Let's see what I make. All right, y'all, I just got finished getting ready. It is 12, 10. I'm about to hit the floor, get this money. Okay, end of the night, me and baby Vanessa, we're splitting up some bread. Hello? Hello? Oh, okay. <laughs> My bag. All right, y'all. It is the next day. I'm going to count my money. So last night wasn't that busy. It got kind of busy towards the end, like at two, three-ish. But it was like not a lot of money going around, if that makes sense. Like... People started coming, but yeah, no one was throwing like big amounts of money. So, okay, first off, I want to say thank you guys for getting me to 100k views on my first stripper vlog. That was a big one for me. Um, I ordered a money counter because everybody was on my ass about it. They're like, "Girl, you need to make, you need a money counter." So, it'll be here in my next video. Oh, and then somebody asked me how much the club takes from us. They don't take much, like from sections. I'll tip them if it's like a big amount of money. So like if I make a thousand in a section, like I'll tip out a hundred. Um, if I do rooms, I tip out 20%. 
Um, and then like we pay house mom. So house mom gets like $20 plus I'll tip her. So if I had a great night, I'll give her a hundred dollars. Um, and then back door is like around 60 to a hundred dollars, depending on, um, how late you came. So yeah. And then DJ, I tip him throughout the night. Like when I want to go on stage or if I want to hear a song. I guess like average, I'll tip out like a hundred at least. So if I had like a decent night, I'll tip out a hundred. If I had a great night, I'll tip out like maybe three hundred. It just all really depends. All right, guys, so I just stacked up the money. This is it right here. I'm about to count it. This one's not counted in eight uh, in 100, so it was $80. But I think I took some to tip out. So yeah, this is the money from last night. I got $40 from a dance. All right, let's start counting. Oh, and then in the first video that I posted, I said that I count in 25s to keep track or whatever, but I'll stack the 25s to make a hundred so i'll stack four 25s and then i'll rubber band the hundred because someone was like you make two hundred dollars not eight hundred and i was like no it was eight hundred so but yeah so i rubber band hundreds i stack 25s So this was my first night back since for like a whole month, honestly. Yeah, because I haven't worked since like Maple 18th or something like that. And then that was like right before my birthday. So then that whole week I was celebrating my birthday and then the week after I went to Mexico. And then when I came back from Mexico, I just took like two weeks to just chill. And I'm looking for a new apartment. So I was looking at apartments a lot just trying to get my life in order honestly but i have a mexico vlog so if you guys want to see that it'll be in the description down below so i just wanted to get another stripper vlog out because i know you guys like those videos so all right y'all so i counted it up so i got 400 rubber bands and then this is 30 so 430 plus 40 so 470 and then a five dollar bill so I made four seventy five yesterday. Not bad for first day back. So yeah, I finally went back to work yesterday, which was Sunday, and this is what I made four seventy five. I'll show you guys my new apartment as soon as I move in. I'll do a like unfinished apartment tour. That's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.